my job title is a talent acquisition associate. So I work in the executive recruitment team, which deal with recruitment at director level and above. I think the best thing about my placement is the opportunities I'm given. So because I work at the headquarters, there's nearly 5,000 people there and there's nearly every department there. So you can almost always reach out to someone if you want more experience in another area. So even though I work in recruitment, I've been able to reach out to other people in, in HR and get some experience in more generalist HR or other areas I'm interested in, which is really great. I found the application process, um, it was quite difficult, but it was worth it in the end. So originally I had to answer a few questions about why I wanted to work at GSK, um, my level of experience on a few Microsoft applications, um, what experience I'd had in the past and things like that. Um, I then had to do a, um, so an online test, um, which was a maths and an English test, which was actually easier than some of the others I'd done. Uh, it wasn't timed, which most of them were, um, which was good because I could actually think about my answers um, in advance, which was, which was good. Um, I then had to go on to do a presentation. So I had to prepare a case study, um, which was good because I got to prepare it in advance and some of the others, you, you're only given sort of half an hour to do it on the day. Um, I then had to answer some competency questions in you know, an interview setting, which was okay. It was, it was based around the company values and then competency questions and again, why I wanted to work at the company. So it was, it was quite good. So the advice I'd give to first and second year students would be to really stay persistent. So when I first started applying, <clears throat> I made a few mistakes. Um, I, you know, I didn't spell check and, and things like that, but through applying to lots of different companies and, and getting feedback, I really learned from that. And it was that persistence that I think got me the job. So if I only applied for one or two companies, I never would have got a job. And I think it was just that learning curve that allowed me to um, improve and eventually get my placement.